Hello, and welcome to the Red Orchestra 2 review. Now you're probably asking yourself, why are we reviewing this game that came out a while back? Well, it's on sale on Steam right now. It's probably not on sale anymore, but this is our thoughts on the game. So, enjoy. Red Orchestra 2 is one of those unique first-person shooters that actually feels realistic and more strategic than others. The graphics are visually impressive, and the guns look and feel realistic. There are two type of game modes, realistic and action. Realistic is exactly what the name suggests. The weapons are stronger and the mode feels more strategic than just running around shooting people. Then there's action mode, a fast paced game mode centered around more casual gameplay. Now if you ask me, this game mode wasn't really necessary, it doesn't make the game any better or worse, but the time they took making this game mode could have been used to make uh, some more creative game modes or maps. Also keep in mind that this game is not as fast paced as it seems. Red Orchestra has a slow but effective combat and the maps are large and very good for teamwork and strategy. If you don't enjoy slow games, you're not going to enjoy this one. All in all, Red Orchestra is a nice addition to the series and I can recommend this game to anybody. It gets an 8.5 out of 10. Also, a quick note, if you're asking yourself, do people still play this game? Many people do. There are a lot of full servers, so don't second guess yourself on this bot. Thank you for watching this review. Um, check out the other reviews and the channel. And check out last week's video, uh, the top five game companies. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.